all right guys so i am just getting ready to go to tj maxx because i have not been at in a TJ Maxx in quite a while. I usually just go to Home Goods. I want to go in TJ Maxx and just look around and see what they have. I like TJ Maxx because you can kind of look at like clothing stuff and house stuff all in one place um, versus Home Goods, just home stuff. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. Also, I'm going to grab some lunch while we're out. I want to try the new Chick-fil-A spicy grilled chicken sandwich. It looks so good. Uh, I love the grilled uh, chicken nuggets at Chick-fil-A. So I'm hoping I really like like this. Do you guys remember like years ago when Chick-fil-A had spicy nuggets? I believe they were like competing with Wendy's at the time when Wendy's like introduced their spicy nuggets. This was like years ago. I think I like... I was probably like still in high school <laughs> when they introduced this um, but I always missed them it was like they only had them out for like a limited amount of time but yeah so when I saw the commercial I was like oh I want to try that so I'm gonna grab some lunch too while I'm out and yeah it's just a really chill day it's so cold hence the hat I do not wear hats I am not a hat girl this isn't even my hat it's my mom's she left it at my house and I was like perfect I can put on a hat today um, because I just never wear hats but it's cold today um, it's gloomy it's just a blah day so I just wanted to get out the house for a little bit get some fresh air and just you know go browse around so yeah let's get going Right, guys so I'm back home now I was gonna take this hat off but I have like major hat hair going on so we just gonna roll with this for now but anyway I went to TJ Maxx and found some really good stuff and I don't know what it is but I did not realize like <laughs> Valentine's Day was coming up like I'm not a big Valentine's Day like person I don't really like celebrate it uh but when you have kids sometimes that forces you to kind of like get in the spirit of certain holidays and things that you wouldn't typically be into and so as soon as we walked into tj maxx it was like an explosion of valentine's day stuff and one i'm not like like reds and like bright pinks and things like that it's like not my thing as you all see here i'm very particular about the decor and the different things that i bring in my home that's kind of like holiday related so i did find some really good stuff at tj maxx i was super surprised um i got some kitchen stuff i got some bedroom stuff and, um knickknack type things that will be fun for Sefton and I to do since I don't know where you live or where you are but technically here in Ohio we are still locked down um obviously we can go out move about but um I don't even think our curfew has been lifted like I think we have like a 10 p.m curfew <laughs> but I'm never out that late anyway so I don't even think about it but for the most part we stay inside all day every day with the exception of going out to run quick little errands to the grocery store or like me going to TJ Maxx or something like that but uh, we're never out for long periods of time um, we don't go and hang out at family's house or anything like that we just go do what we need to do and then just come back home so anyway I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I picked up it feels so weird wearing his head inside but anyway so the first thing that I grabbed this was like one of the first things uh, we saw uh, when we came in when we walked in 
and it's this little mixing bowl set and so they have like three or four different like variations of this and i chose just the plain white bowl with the little hearts kind of carved in it does have like a pour spout it has a handle and i just thought this was super cute for seth and i to kind of like bake and make cookies or brownies or whatever um i just felt like since he's not in school and if you guys know every year for valentine's day since Sefton has been in like preschool i always do a super cute fun like different like valentine's day um theme for his classmates and so because he's doing virtual learning we just did cards this year and we turned them in to his school at the drop off last week and his teacher is going to like distribute them to all of his classmates for him she did send out an email for other parents if they wanted to participate so they're going to do a virtual like valentine's day thing but it's still not the same so i wanted to do some stuff here at home with him just so that you know it can feel like we kind of got in the Valentine's Day spirit here at home. So we're probably gonna bake cookies and you know, who knows what we might do. But this also came with a spoon, spatula, and a little mixer. So I thought that was super cute. This was $14.99 and I thought that was a really good deal. And this is something that, I mean, yeah, it's for Valentine's Day, but I can see myself using this all year round. So that's pretty much what I went with. Once I got in there and I realized like, oh, I wanna get that, I wanna get that. I have to like, it has to be functional. It has to be something that I can use all year round. Um, and it has to be something that I can put out for Valentine's Day decor, but it can also take me into like spring and summer as well. So this was perfect. It doesn't have any like writing or anything on it. It doesn't say anything like I love you and hearts colorful hearts and things like that so i like that the the spoons obviously do but these will be in a drawer and i like the the mixer it's just white with a wooden handle we got that and then i got some little dessert napkins here just has some little hearts on it just red gold and little black polka dot hearts so i thought that was super cute just to have that on the countertop and I also got this three-piece stainless steel cookie cutter set. Uh, it has EXO, a heart, and then a double heart there. So this would be super cute to make with cookies, to make some cookies. Uh, this was $2.99. And the napkins, I'm sorry, the napkins were $2.99 as well. And then i needed a new cookie sheet so i saw this one it's like this rose pink color which i thought was really cute so i got this it was 7.99 it's really nice a little cookie sheet and i go through cookie sheets like crazy i don't know about you guys but my cookie sheets be looking like super crazy i don't know where i'm gonna put this i'm gonna have to rearrange some things on my countertop but i could not leave without getting this marble heart shape like cake stand how cute is this i could not pass this up if you're familiar with my kitchen which i'm sure a lot of you are um i do love to have like little hints of marble in there so yeah this was $14.99 and i'm gonna find somewhere on my counter to put this because it's just too cute and again something like this i can keep this out all year round it doesn't scream valentine's day um but it's just so sweet and just i just love it so i got that and i'm not sure if i'm gonna like maybe put this on my desk or what but it's like this really soft pink vase and it says it was handcrafted in thailand um, I got it marked down to $7. The original price was $14.99, but because it has a crack here, the lady um, took off some money for me, so that was really nice. Yeah, and because it's in the back, I can kind of turn around and hide that, so I wasn't really too, too concerned. But I just thought it was nice, so I may put this on my desk area or somewhere here on my coffee table, but I just thought it was super cute, and I love that it's not like bright pink but it's not like a baby like pink either it's just a real subtle pink and see like you can see close up the wood is kind of like peeking through as well i'm not sure how well it's coming up on camera but i just thought it was super cute and again something that i can put out now for valentine's day and this will take me into spring and summer as well and just look really really nice so it's almost like a 
a milky pink color, kind of like my nail polish, to be honest. So I thought that was super cute. And I also picked up the Zara Home White Jasmine Linen Spray. I will put this probably in my bedroom. And this was $4.99. I just wanted to switch up my bedroom a little bit, so I just got two things. Um, I picked up this little throw, and it is by Sullivan Manor. It was $14.99. It's a very just like soft pink. I like that it has a little fringe on the end and it's just a really nice soft plush throw blanket that I can just like throw on the end of my bed. Just make it a little bit more feminine because um, right now it's just like tan. <laughs> so I thought this would be just cute to add to the bed. And then I found this really nice pillow. Um, as you can see a close up that actually goes perfect with the throw so i'm just going to add this to my bed it's just a little accent pillow with my other pillows that i already have which are white um so this will go well and so yeah this pillow was $19.99 and i just thought this would be a nice little pop in my bedroom area so i got that so yeah guys that is everything that i got on my little TJ Maxx outing today. I hope you all 